Yes, yes, yes! And I'm calling it the Nuggery Game! Appendix Audition! So, you may as well betray them. So will this be the quirk in there? Or... No, this is probably, if anything, going to be a clover ending or a bad end, because results, please stop. Unless the results change, maybe clover gets betrayed now and Kate gets out. Try betray, betray, betray ally. Try betray. Points, please check. Hey, what's the Quark deal? Quark had nothing to do with it. I entered the vote. So why'd you choose Betray? Couldn't I ask you the same thing? I don't really think this is the time for a fight, though. Look, Clover's over by the door. What? what? Oh, no. door. Fuck, she opened it. Ugh! Why? Clover, wait! Clover, what the hell do you think you're doing? I'm going to call the others. What? I get justice for Alice. Justice? Wait, do you mean... Dio left at Clover, his fists raised. Clover easily avoided him and moved toward the door. Goodbye. I caught one last glimpse of her face as she slid through the door. It was a mass of ice. is not enough. okay and that should be a bad ending all right that's that so we still have a password for the computer I mean, I know it, but we haven't seen it in game, so I'm not going to do it. Lock number one, how can find K be saved? And lock number three, five minutes of life. So, five minutes of life. So I guess we got to betray here to get another, like, bad ending. What even was this one? Well, I guess we'll betray and find out. Is this the one where... Hold on. Uh, this is where we go into the chromatic door, we go into the red door into the lab, get the accelerator, and then we ally where we're supposed to, and then we die, or we betray. Who breaks the accelerator? Okay. Clover and I walked slowly out of the AB room. Dio glanced over at us as he exited his own room. I looked away before he could make eye contact. Sigma, why? 
after all that stuff you said. I mean, it's not like I'm criticizing you. I think you made the right decision. Sorry. You don't need to apologize. I think I would have chosen Betray if I was in your position. We'll find another way, all right? We just have to keep an eye on Dio. As soon as he gives us an opening, we take it. A and I'm sure Alice will help us too. Did you tell her? It's okay. We can trust Alice. There's no way she told him. Anyway, let's go check the results. Yeah. Oh, Alice isn't dead in this timeline. Wait, where the hell were Alice and... Yeah, obviously. So Kay can get out now, though. Results from round two of the Ambidex Why game will now there? be displayed. Please check your bracelet. To see your update. An idiot. Hey, what the hell is this? <laughs> Sorry, I decided to choose betray. Oh, so you don't care what happens to Quark? <laughs> what kind of a cold-hearted bastard are you? <laughs> Please, just give it back. Hey, Sigma, what are you talking about? You found the Accelerator in the lab. And Dio stole it. What? You mean he has it right now? Nah, I don't have it. What? Well, I won't have it in about two seconds. The moment the words left his mouth, I knew what we planned to do. No, don't. I leapt forward toward him as I spoke, but it was already too late. Dio snatched the vial out of his pocket, brought it up, and threw it to the ground. No! He threw it on the ground. You bastard. What are you doing? A promise is a promise. If you chose an ally, this never would have happened. You want to blame someone? Blame yourselves. God. I've had enough. Something snapped in my brain. Bastard! I let out a guttural roar and went forward. Only to be stopped short by a firm hand on my arm. It was fine. Hold it. Why are you stopping me? Because this isn't the time for that. Huh? What do you mean this isn't the Look time the for that? Look at the number 9 door. Okay. Okay, was indeed standing in front of the door. What? What no! is he? 9. His BP is 9. What? Suddenly we were all running toward K in the number 9 door. Oh yeah, ten Yoji defaulted to ally. Okay, what the hell do you think you're what doing? What am I doing? Well, that should be obvious. But if you insist, I am attempting to leave. Are you fucking kidding me? I assure you, I would do no such thing. I am perfectly serious. After a rational assessment of the facts, I have concluded that this is the wisest course of action. What is currently our highest priority? The answer is, of course, to save Quark. He must be taken to a hospital as soon as possible for that to happen. One of us must escape and call for help. Currently, the only one of us capable of doing so is myself. That is why I intend to escape. And leave us all behind. Unavoidable. But as I said, I do intend to call for help. Couldn't you have at least waited until the next round? Then you could have raised Quark's BP to 9 and taken him with you. And what would happen if Dio was Quark's opponent in the next round? I have no illusions about what <laughs> Dio would do. <laughs> this what is the most Dio. logical choice. So, you know, I didn't know this. Alice was also not, like, her picture was not there when they showed Ruby's the picture for the like, votes. I think it's because he punches her and he votes betray. It will remain open for nine seconds. Like, she's probably unconscious Wait, in the room. Where's Alice? Yeah, there we go. Yes, Alice is in the AB room. She has collapsed, but you needn't be concerned. She is only sleeping. Oh, no. What did you do to Alice? You will need to ask her yourself. I must take my leave. Hey! God damn it! Wait! Dio charged at Kay, but the larger man easily sidestepped him and tumbled nimbly through the door just before it closed.
The number nine door has closed. This ends the memory game. Thank you for your participation. As the game is over, all doors other than the number nine door. Escape, please. Yeah, okay, we'll try There we go, three endings in real quick succession. So I suppose next we may as well betray in round one. So this is just after doing the infirmary. Phi and Tenyoji, I think. Is this when she we rock paper scissors and she lets us decide? It's fine. I stepped out of the AB room. I could see it was rushing towards the projection, shoving and pushing it closer. Tenyoji was left behind. His footsteps is slow, heavy plod. What had happened to make him like that? You chose betray, huh? That's messed up. What you said I should. Hey. I didn't say that. I just asked you a question. What would happen to our BP if Ten Miyoji chose to betray us? It was a leading question. <laughs> oh, I get it. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. I was wondering why you were so happy to let me choose after you lock in the lost paper scissors. You were playing against me as a scapegoat was all I? God damn it. You was a kids doing over there we're about to announce the result anyway we need to go have a look at the results first come on <laughs> hey wait shit good 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 it looks like you're all here finally let's get ready to rock If everybody would please direct their eyes to So, Kay Lobo, Betray Luna, the Uncork Betray Alice, and we betray Ten Yoji. So six sixes, three ones. Here are the results from your game. Now, let us check the numbers on our bracelets. I got betrayed? He chose ally? Why? He chose betray last time. Last time? What are you talking about? Oh, uh, nothing. The truth was I didn't know why it said that earlier. The words just appeared in my mouth before I knew I was saying them. Oh, you're the one who chose Betray. I should be asking you why. I told him you might choose Betray. Fine. I can't believe you. I'd never choose Betray. I trusted you two, and this is what I got. Ah, uh, I apologize. Fine, you don't need to apologize. I was the one who did it. I pushed oh, the button. Oh, yeah. I guess you've got a point. Huh? Wait, what? It's Sigma's fault. You want to blame someone, blame him. What the hell, Fi? Uh, what, you're gonna fight each other now? I don't care which one of you pushed the button. I'm never trusting either of you again. This isn't over. Just you wait. I tried to think of something to say, but before I could come up with the right words, he was gone. I spun around. Fi, what the fu- But she was gone too. Gahaha, <laughs> who the hell? How'd she just disappear like that? As I looked around the room for Fi, I noticed that Clover, Kay, and Luna seemed to be having some kind of argument as well. I moved closer and did my best to listen surreptitiously. Why did you do it? Sorry. I guess I wanted to get out of here as soon as possible, you know? I apologize, but I felt the same way. But if we all choose Ally, then we could all escape together. It only takes three turns to get six points. That would be enough to get us out. Why? Well, of course we know that. But if we betray, then it's... If your opponent chooses ally and you choose betray, then you gain three points. Do that twice and you get six points, you see? If you ally, then you have to play the AB game three times. But if you betray somebody, you only have to do it twice. Why are you acting like that's the right thing to do? I almost feel like you're blaming me or something. We aren't trying to blame you. But, I mean, if you just think about it, wouldn't a 
it make sense to choose Betray? Forget it. I understand now. It was silly of me to trust you guys. Luna walked off with her head buried between her shoulders. Her back trembled as if perhaps she were crying, but I couldn't see her face. Alice, Dio, and Corkcarver seem to be having some issues of their own. Hmm. Fine. You just wait. Man. This is all your fault, Quark. My fault? Why are you blaming me? They exchanged dark looks and stomped off in different directions. Zero, when does the next round start? What makes you think we'll be having another round? Well... Here, I can skip this part. Forgot I gotta, like, skip a bunch of this shit. Alright, everybody dies. Yeah, 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 everybody dies. Just like everybody poops. Oh, right, we get the whole backstory with the car and the gas and the zero and the phi. Oh, we have to go at all these again, I think. So I think the dialogue is different now. Nope, it's the same. Well, it's probably slightly different just because we're going in different orders, but it doesn't look like it's going to change, actually. So it looks like it's just after each oh, Sigma, no. what do you want? What do I want? I think I'm here to play doctor? Let me hear secretly Clover. Tell you what, how about I'll be the doctor, you get on the exam table, and I'll cut you open with that scalpel over there. Man, are you still pissed? What the hell do you think? My BP's down to one thanks to you. Come on, I already told you I was yes, sorry. Yes, and that makes it all better, you goddamn idiot. Well, then what the heck am I supposed to do? Piss off. Seems like I'm already doing that. You don't know the half of it. Just get out of my sight. Easy solution, then. Just close your eyes. Leave before I make yours black. The last guy I fought went home in an ambulance. Shouldn't have picked a fight with a paramedic, then. Shut up. Fine. I shoved my hands in my pocket and looked around the room. That was good. That took me a second to get, but I like that. It was good. So, is it just you here? On this side of the divider, yeah. This side. Quark's over there, having a look around. And there's... <laughs> you really gonna make me say it? Oh, uh, the lady who was murdered, you mean? Yeah, you've been acting kind of weird ever since you found her. Oh, what? That? Isn't that normal? We found a dead body. Who the hell? I think that's the rest of this. Yeah, yeah right. Before. Like, I'm gonna tell that to someone who betrayed me. Yeah, yeah just keep bringing it up. Alright, fine. I'll just ask Quark. He was just standing there, a blank face, a blank, slightly confused look on his face. Hey, Quark? You alright? Can you hear me? Huh? What is something happening? He turned to look at Tenyoji. He looked back, confused. Weren't you listening to our conversation? Yeah, you were just talking so fast. I couldn't really understand. Fast? My head felt kind of foggy. And I couldn't really make out what you were saying. <sighs> I'm fine now, though. Whatever it was seems to be gone. Are you sure you're okay? I think I'm just tired. Being stuck in this place is pretty exhausting. And, and... He glanced at the bed in the back of the room. On it lay the body of the old woman. What? Tenyoji, what the hell were you thinking? You can't let Quirk huh? back here. Oh, yeah. Right. Quark, get over here. Um, anyway, you really sure you can? Yeah. Maybe Luna should have a look at you. Supposedly, she's some sort of doctor. I said I was fine. Gosh, Grandpa, you're such a worrier. You always freak out over nothing. I'm fine. Oh, it looks to me like you're doing fine. I guess we don't have to worry yep. about anything. Come on. Let's get... I'm guessing you didn't find a secret passage. Now. Nope. Heist. No secret passages. <laughs> I'll go check up on the others then. Hey, OG. Keep an eye on him, alright? You think I need you to tell me that? Alright, now quick work. And we should be able to skip all of this. It should be the same conversation with Alice and Luna. Alice and Clover, sorry. About, uh,. Your time in the SOIS. Actually, I don't think they even dropped the association last time, so... Oh, no secret passages. Yeah, you go. Anything different this time? Any different dialogue? 
then before one of us could break the silence. <laughs> Ken Yoji? What's Luna? wrong? Luna! Where's Luna? She's not here. What's wrong? It's Quark. Something bad's happened. Hey, calm down. We're not going Quark. He just collapsed. I have to find Luna. She said she was some kind of a doctor. Luna's over in the lounge. Where's Quark? She's in the infirmary. Got it. I'll go get Luna and you head back to the infirmary. Clover, Alice, okay. you're with me. Right. We pulled it out of the crew quarters and headed toward the lounge. And Luna. There we go. So, we find out he has Radical 6 either way. We, like, anesthetize him, take the scalpel. Alice takes the scalpel. Uses it to kill herself later, I guess. So, how are you I won't do go this? with Sigma. He betrayed me last time. What about 5? You hit the button, right, Sigma? Well, yeah, I'm a... I don't want to go with Dio. Same reason. I can't trust that he won't betray me again. Uh, thanks a lot, Quark. You've single-handedly torpedoed my reputation. Well, that leaves us with option B. No, we can't do option B. Why not? Sorry, Luna. But I can't trust you or Vi either. The way he is right now, someone's going to have to carry Quark. I just can't afford to give him to someone I don't trust. Why doesn't he trust Luna? <laughs> I thought you trusted Fi. Not enough for this. Then what do you intend to do? Quark shifted silently in Kay's arms. Quark is a solo, as are you, Tenmyoji. Solos can't pair with one another. You do remember that. Yeah, of course I do. I didn't say there wasn't anyone I trusted. There's one person. <laughs> do you trust them? What? Me? Yeah, that's what I said. Why? I can't tell you. I just know that you'll keep him safe. Uh -huh. It's nice of you to say, but... Knowing what I know, this seems kind of... Well, okay. My I'll partner is Sigma. Are you sure you want me to take him? It's fine. Clover, you just vote by yourself. Make Sigma wait outside the AB room. No. If Clover takes Quark, then we have to go with option C, right? That means I'll be stuck with Dio. There's no way in hell I'm going to let that happen. Who do you want to pair up with then? Isn't it obvious? Quark. Remember what the announcement said? Something about how the system will automatically vote ally for anyone who doesn't enter their own vote in time if Quark doesn't wake up by then. No! This is exactly why I can't trust any of you! One minute remains. We don't have time to argue this. Let's take a vote. Those opposed to C? Alice and Dio's hand went up. What? Why don't you want C, Dio? Well, if she's got that much of a hate on for me... That hardly plays into my hands, does it? Mm, fine, whatever. I assume anyone who didn't raise their hand is all right with option C, then? No one objected. I kept my mouth shut, too. Just as Alice had said, there was an excellent chance that Quark would default to ally. If that happened, he'd make a great opponent. I'd choose ally, of course, but it would be good not to not have to worry about him choosing the tray. All right. Six to two in favor. Wait, what about me? Stay here if you don't like it. I imagine your partner might have something to say about that, though. Kay handed Quirk to me gently, then crossed his arms and turned to face Alice. Her jaw clenched as she stared up at him and I could see the gears turning inside her head. Fine. Ten seconds remain until chromatic doors close. <laughs> Hurry, Clover. The door's closed. Right! Hey, take care of Quark. Don't worry about it. I got a good grip on Quark, nodded to Ten Yoji, and took off the door. Our feet slapped against the metal door as we ran. The empty voice of the announcer echoed in my ears. Two, one, zero. Chromatic doors closing. Huh? Is that dead end? Well, there are three doors here, but it looks like they're all locked. Hmm. What's this thing? It's got a lever on it. Can you pull the lever? Come on, my hands are kind of full oh, right now. yeah. I can take Quark then. You really don't want to touch that thing. Well, I mean, look at it. It looks suspicious. Like I'm going to touch it and 
Whoosh, a bunch of poison needles fly out of the wall. Maybe if I had, like, a piece of wood to move it with or something. <laughs> I think you might be a little paranoid. Then you do it! Fine. I shifted Quirk over to one shoulder and flipped the switch with my free hand. Now we get to go to the treatment center. Convenient that we have Quirk. See? No needles. Everything's For now, fine. only one of the doors opened. <laughs> Did you see the plaque on the door before it opened? I think it's a something in a treatment center. Do you think that's some kind of medical thing? First an infirmary, now this. Why do I keep ending up in these places? I glance over at Quark to sleep on my shoulder. Hey, you know what? We may have looked huh? at What do you mean? Well, if this is where they treat people, maybe they've got something that can cure Quark. Oh, yeah. Let's head on in okay. then. There's our lion eating the sun. What are those? It says on the side, treatment pod. So I guess it treats people? Maybe you can help Quark. Yeah! Damn, no good, it's locked. Let's take a look around. Maybe something in here will tell us how to unlock okay. this door. Whoever nodded and bounced off to examine the room. I lay Quirk down just outside of the door to the treatment center. Clover might have been overly paranoid about the liver, but there was no harm in being cautious. Hang on there, little guy. We'll get you fixed up soon. I ruffled his hair gently, then turned and headed back into the room. I had some investigating to do.